All right, guys, before we get into this video, I want to talk to you about foottrading.co.uk. It's a website run by myself and V273, where we help you guys to make millions of coins on FIFA every single month. I know you guys mentioned that I talk about it a lot in my videos, but the reason for that is the website helps allow us both to be full time. And it means I'm able to bring out three, sometimes four videos a day on YouTube because I can pay for an editor and give those who can't afford the website um, as many trading tips as I possibly can do. £10 a month gets you access to tier one, which gives you buying and selling prices for silver cards, special cards, icons, and Thursday flips. Tier two is £15 a month. It includes all of tier one and access to live filters, our chem style area, which is extremely effective right now. Hundreds of thousands of coins being made every day from there. And our fluctuation area, where we monitor the market for lows and highs, allowing you to make as much coins as possible. So make sure you check it out. But for now, let's get into the video. Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to a new video with me, Fuzzball40. As always, if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe down below and make sure you turn on your notifications so you never miss an upload. I upload three times a day. The morning video is usually League SPC Method to Glory, me teaching you guys how to craft packs and players for free and uh, just grinding out League SPC Method. It's great fun. The evening video is always me trading, teaching you guys how to trade. At the moment, we're running a 1 till 5 million series, basically trading from 1 million to 5 million in 10 days going very well uh, but if you guys are new to trading make sure you check out the main video on the channel it's me trading from 1k to 1 million in four days teaching you guys how to do it it's it was brilliant i really enjoyed it and you guys have loved it so make sure you check it out um, and then the midnight content is this content it is the whatever content ea released to us at 6 p.m and like i said the 80 plus player picks are back they're about 6k each to do and they are the best upgrade pack on this game in my opinion um, i've just done a set on my brother's account uh, they were released today um, and one of my mods, Luke, has gone and put 30 more together for us. Again, site subscriber, millions in the bank, check out for trading. Um, but he's going to put some together for us. Now, depending on how each of these goes, well, depending on what day these go, go live on, but they're just OP as packs, they're incredible. Um, and on Sean's account, they went very, very well. So I'm hoping that we can do the same on Luke's account. A lot of people saying tonight they're very hit and miss, but I, I do rate this as content from EA because they were very OP last time. And I literally thought to myself, there is no chance EA are giving us these packs back again. And they've gone and done oh, that. Oh, as Fuji is, is <laughs> Fuji's the greatest. Thank you for the follow. Is that Fuji himself? I wonder. Um, but we're going to get into it now. He's got 30 player picks for us to open up as another icon sells, I'm pretty sure. We're going to flick open the first one. Start off with a nice Gabriel Jesus, which is not bad at all. We'll take that without a doubt. Again, what's he currently selling for? Whatever what the pack of this is. Like, what, 7,000 coins or so? Very solid start from that. Second pick, we're going to go for 83 I Tour because he's the highest rated. That's what I tend to go for for him, highest rated rather than anything else. Um, again, 82 Payet, not that great. These are not the best start at all, to be fair, compared to what we started last time. And then we get a headliner! Taco Akambi! That is a dub. I don't know what he sold for. I don't think it's much, but that is a dub. I don't care. He will be buzzing with that. Taco Akambi. That looks like a half-decent card, that. School moves a little bit iffy, but nice headliner pack. That is sensational. 85 Sane, these things are a joke. These things are an utter joke. I love them. I literally cannot get enough of these picks. Uh, we're going to go with... I'm actually going to go with... I'm going with Van Der Beek, just because he's Premier League, but if he was a League FBC grind, I would have gone for Aaron Gies instead. Um, 84, 85. Eric <laughs> These packs are a joke. These They're just a joke. They're just incredible. I literally love them. Um, we're going to Dzeko here. Tadic. We always avoid Tadic for like, the plague. Okay, when we're going to get Jacko again. We'll get Lacazette this time instead, which is not too bad. But so far, we've got Ed Eriksson, we've got Sane, we've got Turco Akambi, a headliner, Gabriel Jesus. It's a very good start on this one. Next pick. Could go highest rated again and go Suso. Suso will do. Pick after this. We'll go with... Go yeah, Marcus Lorente, why not? That card's still so OP, it's a joke. Ridiculous card. Uh, 83 Oscar here, although Sanchez has more value. No, go Oscar. We're going to go rating. We don't need value. We want rating here. That's what matters. That is what matters. We've already got Suso, so we'll go Benitez here. Nearly halfway through these picks. In terms of fodder, not as, as OP as it's been on Luke's account, perhaps, but uh, as on Luke's account, account, but we have got a headliner, so we can't really complain too much about that. Um, we'll go Edin Militao here. So, these are good. They're not bad at all. Toko Kambi is a big, big pull. So is Sane, so is Ericsson. Um, other than that, though, a bit iffy in terms of other cards. The other ones are a bit, bit iffy. But we'll go through second half of them. Hopefully, we continue to get some good stuff. Not on this one, we don't. Tiedemans. Next pick. Carbonier. 
We'll take a Fernandinho. That's solid. We'll take that. That's definitely that pick paid for. Well, more than that. That's a couple of picks paid for with him, which is very solid. $85 dollar This is more like it. This is more like it, EA. You love to see it. Donna Rumor there. We'll go Ben Chilwell. Why not? Bit of chili. Don't know what he sells for. Nah, not much. Again, 83 rated. We'll take that. Moon Iron was inflated like mad the other day. Yeah, he's back. He's still inflated like now. Very inflated. And the final one of this page. We're going to go for Hector Bellerin just for the bands. Look at that hair. It's so much better than it used to be. Oh my god, he's got another headliner. <laughs> he's literally packed two headliners. Two headliners. <laughs> Danny Ings. He'll be buzzing with that. Now, I, just, I don't want to hit anyone tell me these packs are terrible. This card's actually a beast, apparently. Like an utter beast of a card. Uh, but yeah, Danny Ings as well, which is very, very good. <laughs> two headliners packed from less than 30 picks so far. Kingsley Coman as well. We'll take that as a dub. Definitely take that as a dub. Yeah, he's done well. He's done very, very well. Tagliafico. He's 8,500 coins or something like that at the moment anyway. He's extremely expensive. Luke's definitely got his money back here. How many picks have we got left? We've got six picks left. Imagine we make it three headliners. 84, Pizzy. The second half definitely picked up. It definitely picked up. These are paid for themselves more than over. So five picks left, including this one. We'll go with Senyo because he hasn't got him yet. Mm, we'll go Rui really for rating. Again, he doesn't league SBC grind, so it doesn't really matter. And then three more player picks. Go Marco Asensio. No matter what, now I'm happy. I think he'll be happy. Two or two headliners is very, very solid. They can sit in this club. Final two picks. The EA fancy being kind. Not really. And then the final 80 plus pick on Luke's account. It's going to be 82 Correa. So that's what I let it down a little bit. Now, there's not a lot of fodder here. Like, there's a decent amount of fodder, don't get me wrong. You've got, what, Oscar, Pizzi, Tagliafico, Lacazette, Coleman, Jacko, Eriksson, Sane, Munayin, Van Der Beek, Donnarumma, Vernat. Actually, there's a lot of fodder here. This, these, these are just insane. They're ridiculous. But moreover, two headliners packed in 30 of these. Absolutely ridiculous hit rate of these. And again, this Inks card gets one or two more boosts, and he's going to be utterly ridiculous. Like, it's going to be a mad, mad card. If you can get, like, celebrate that pace up to sort of the 86, 87s, with sort of 90 shooting, it's ridiculous. Toko Kambi, I don't think he's going to fit into his team anywhere, but it's still a decent card. Like, it is still a very, very good card, without a doubt. Um, but, yeah, madness. Fernandinho, I think, is pace for two of these. So even if you look at, like, Fernandinho, Donnarumma, Sane, Eriksson, Komen... They will pay for like two each without a doubt. Tagliafico then, Lacazette's what paying for themselves realistically. Same as Gabriel Jesus and the rest of them are sort of iffy picks. But for an upgrade pack that doesn't cost very much to do, this is insane. Get out and do this. Forget the 81 plus double. Forget all of those. Just do the 80 plus player pick. It's far better than any of them. But that's the end of the video. If you are new around here, as always, make sure you subscribe down below. Make sure you turn on your notifications so you never miss an upload. But for now, lads, I am out. Peace out. I'll speak to you soon.